are all of you ready for the presentations today? Yes, ma'am. Good. Uh, um, should we start with Adnan? Or... Yes, ma'am. Uh, today, the topic of my presentation is Safai Anthem, Hogas of Pakistan. It is a campaign that is launched by AIY Digital back in December 2019. Next, ma'am. Okay. Uh, first of all, uh, we will discuss about the market context of this campaign. <clears throat> so AIY Digital, as you all know, that it has always played a very effective role in highlighting the major issues of Pakistan, uh, including from climate change to all other issues that are uh, linked with the general masses. <clears throat> uh, actually, this basically, this idea came from a report that was launched by German Watch and as per that report, Pakistan is the fifth most affected country by the climate change. So from here, they picked up the idea that it is the right time to launch this campaign in order to uh, increase the awareness among the general masses. Next one. OK. To tackle the adverse effect of climate change and to make Pakistan clean and green, a song with the title Safai Anthem has been launched in December 19 by AIY Digital. Actual date of this uh, launching of this anthem was uh, 16th December. <clears throat> it includes, as per the market context uh, strategy, it includes several strategies and advertisement method to educate the general masses about the clean and green method as a collective effort rather than individual effort is the need of the hour in order to tackle the climate adverse hazards. Next one. Uh, as far as the objective of this campaign is concerned, this anthem is an effort of AIY Digital towards Hogas of Pakistan. The main objective of Safai Anthem is to instill responsibility in Pakistani citizens to keep themselves and their surrounding clean. There is a total different objective of this campaign just because this is an awareness campaign rather than a campaign that is uh, to be to be used to increase the I mean business or revenues etc. It is purely an awareness campaign, so its only objective is to instill the responsibilities in Pakistani citizen that cleanliness is rarely desired, and it's their main objective. Next one. So, uh, channel strategy. Uh, Actually, slide the main channel strategy, I guess. Yes, channel strategy. <laughs> In order to fulfill uh, the criteria of this campaign, the channel used to spread the message through Spy Anthem are electronic media. They only use two mediums electronic media, and in that electronic media, they only use TVCs, TV commercial. And in social media, they only use their AIY digital YouTube channel. So these channel it is assured that the message is delivered to every Pakistani to achieve the goal of clean Pakistan. So the, uh, because this is purely an ARY digital personal campaign, so they only use the TVCs of ARY digital <clears throat> and a YouTube channel of ARY digital. So the creative strategy, uh, so in creative strategy, I just highlighted a fact uh, which I read from the article that music is an un impactful way <clears throat> to mobilize masses. Uh, this is basically from Humayu Tafarbi, who is marketing director of a multinational. The anthem envisions South Pakistan featuring the most influential actor of Pakistani media, including Fahad Mustafa, Pakistani film and TV actor, and a host of game show in a, on airing on AIY Digital. Everybody knows about Fahad Mustafa. He's a well-known uh, anchor. Uh, Sh Shanaira Akram, wife of legendary cricketer Vaseem Akram as prime champion, so prime Safai champion. Uh, Vaseem Badami, Pakistani TV host and AIY News anchor. Ahmed Shah, uh, most popular child on TikTok. Next one. Ikrarul Hassan, TV uh, presenter and journalist. This anthem has been sung by most trending singer, uh, singer Asi Mazhar, Aima Beg, and the composition was done by Shuja Heather. They uh, three uh, are well known on Coke Studio. <clears throat> and uh, next, in the last, uh, the anthem has been shown on Air by Digital Pakistan in TVCs and has been posted on official YouTube channel on Air by Digital on 16 December 2019. Next one. As far as the measurement criteria is concerned, that how we are we going to evaluate the campaign, then whether whether it was successful or not, the success of the strategy would be seen through the viewers first thing, 
and the commentators on the social media second thing on crowd activities third thing social media impression fourth cleanliness awareness uh, fifth and the several other education programs after the release of this anthem envisioning saaf pakistan so these are basically six measurement criteria which i will uh, which i will evaluate further in the results next ma'am results <clears throat> so under this campaign several clean uh, program including cleaning of karachi beach by students of iobm has been started in pakistan under the influence of this anthem and the students collected more than 50 kg of litter in, in this cleanliness pre, uh, drive at beach or uh, i have shared the picture of that uh, as well Uh, the audience is uh, as far well as the awareness is concerned the audience is increasing gradually so does the idea of clean pakistan is spreading at large scale in pakistan the anthem has read official youtube channel uh, the anthem on official youtube channel and airway digital has reached uh, 8 lakh 20074 views and more than 18000 comments <laughs> a little more effort have unimaginable results next month Uh, this is the last slide where i have concluded most of the results on ground activities there were around 5, uh, 5 lakh pakistani engaged in on on ground activities social media impression there were 300 million social media impression cleanliness awareness 40000 rural household reach uh, or several other education program which i have mentioned uh, down there collaboration of that all and i have also mentioned the comments of some of some uh, some comments on uh this slide about this hoga pansa pakistan drive so uh, uh then uh, we'll move to the key learning next slide uh, so key learning success of this strategy to spread message mm. of clean and green pakistan reveal that same would be a good strategy in future and uh, that's it for my presentation all right thank you uh जी अदनान से कोई क्वेश्चंस हैं किसी के नो मैम ऑल राइट मैं आपको अदनान के ना आई वांट यू टू लुक एट कपल ऑफ हिस्स स्लाइड्स ओके अब इसका uh, ये जो स्लाइड था चैनल स्ट्रेटजी का uh, इस स्लाइड पे आई एम ओनली सीइंग टीवीसीज एंड सोशल मीडिया यूट्यूब चैनल ठीक है और जब हम जाते हैं यहाँ पे रिजल्ट्स पे और एक्टिविटीज पे तो ही वाज एक्चुअली टॉकिंग अबाउट मोर एक्टिविटीज तो कैन समबडी टेल मी कि वो यहाँ पे उसने चैनल्स में तो सिर्फ ये दो तीन दो चीजें ही मेंशन की हैं कैन समबडी टेल मी कि कौन सी और चीजें हैं जिनके वो रिजल्ट्स एंड मेजरमेंट्स बता रहा था बट दीज थिंग आर नॉट एक्चुअली मैं उसने मैं ऐसे बात कर रहा हूँ जी 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 तो मैम आई थिंक कि उसने जो वो फील्ड का बताया है जो आगे स्कूल्स में शुरू हुआ था और जिस तरह के जो एक वो हैशटैग यूज स्टार्ट हो गया था उसने उस चीज का मेंशन नहीं किया उस चीज में जो फील्ड की एक चीज वो स्टार्ट हो गई थी ना वो जहाँ पे उसने ये ये पांच लाख लोगों ने इसमें पार्टिसिपेट किया उसने वो चीज आई थिंक मैंशन नहीं की अच्छा हाँ एग्जैक्टली exactly. ये मैं आपकी ये डिस्कस कर रही थी कि चैनल स्ट्रेटेजी में आपने सिर्फ दो चैनल्स मेंशन किए हैं टीवीसीज एंड यूट्यूब जबकि आप मेजरमेंट्स एंड रिजल्ट्स में यू आर एक्चुअली टॉकिंग अबाउट मोर चैनल्स ठीक है उसमें आपने काफी सारी दूसरी एक्टिविटीज का भी जिक्र किया था तो इट्स एक्सट्रीमली इम्पोर्टेंट कि जितनी एक्टिविटीज दैट यू आर रिपोर्टिंग रिजल्ट ऑफ या जिनकी आप मेजरमेंट्स बता रहे हैं ऑल ऑफ दो शुड बी मैं तो आप ठीक है ऑन ग्राउंड एक्टिविटीज मुझे यहाँ पे लिखनी चाहिए थी लेकिन अपार्ट फ्रॉम द इम्प्रेशन और कमेंट्स तो वो तो सारे सोशल मीडिया से लिंक है हाँ, लेकिन आपने सोशल मीडिया पे सिर्फ यूट्यूब चैनल मैंशन किया हुआ है ट्विटर और फेसबुक को भी यूज कर रहे थे तो यू आर सेइंग कि यहाँ पे जो आपने मेजरमेंट्स बताई हैं ऑन ग्राउंड ग्राउंड मेजरमेंट्स इस पे तो देखें ना आपने कहा है कि व्यूज पे आपने लिखा हुआ है यहाँ पे ना यू कैन सी कि यहाँ yes, आपने लाइक्स भी कलेक्ट की मेंशन की हुई है दूसरी चीजें भी yes, तो बेसिकली yes, आपको मैं सिर्फ इतना कह रही थी कि आपने यहाँ पे इस इससे आपका ए आर वाई डिजिटल यूट्यूब की आपको मेजर रिजल्ट यहाँ पे नजर आ रहे हैं सो so बेसिकली 
आप सिर्फ ये देखें कि एनी थिंग दैट यू हैव मैंशनड इन मेजरमेंट्स एंड रिजल्ट शुड ऑल्सो भी मैंशन इन चैनल ठीक है वो तमाम एक्टिविटीज जिनको okay. आप रिजल्ट में के तौर पे मेंशन कर रहे हैं तो या मेजरमेंट्स जिनकी बता रहे हैं ऑल ऑफ देम शुड ऑल्सो बी मैंशन इन इन देयर एज वेल ओके ऑल राइट थैंक यू थैंक यू गुड प्रेजेंटेशन नेक्स्ट कौन है जी एस एन ओके सो द मैम I chose the product Shan Foods, uh, and I will be talking about uh, the measurement of the effectiveness of biryani masala campaign. Uh, next slide, please. This is the picture of the pack of the biryani masala. Next slide, please. And <clears throat> they uh, Shan Food had a collaboration with Ogilvy, and their media partners were Facebook, Twitter, and YouTube. Okay, so I will be uh, talking about uh, nine elements uh, about the Shan Foods campaign, uh, its objective, their strategy, uh, their uh, video creation, the channels, and the choices, and then the measurements and the results, and then the key learning. Next slide, please, ma'am. Yes. Okay. Uh, please, so this, uh, sorry, may interrupt. Can you also mention, you know, somewhere that your uh, target audience was? I think Adnan should have mentioned it too, uh, or yeah, maybe yeah. I missed it. But do mention your target audience also, ji. Okay. Okay. So, ma'am, about the Shan Foods campaign. Um, so basically, uh, a bit of the background. Um, Shan Foods is over sixty-five countries since nineteen eighty-one. They offer Food spices, and uh, I will be talking about the uh, biryani masala. So, with the with the number of Chinese people resettling in Pakistan for the CPAC project, Chan Foods came up with the idea of food sharing with neighbors as one of the best ways to bring neighbors close to each other. They did this with the collaboration of Gulwi India and Pakistan. They launched a video art in 2017. Uh, for the biryani masala, which shares the message of peace and tolerance among the society, as we all know, uh, we have a very strong belief in rights of neighbors in in Islam. So they took forward this idea to make an ad uh, between local of uh, like local people of Pakistan and the Chinese people who are resettling. Next slide, please. Okay. So the objective of this campaign was the effectiveness of the recipes, which means that how easy it is for other people to make the biryani, which is shown in the video as well. That a, a Chinese woman make a biryani just by looking at the back side of the package where they have. Told us the steps how to make a biryani. So the next objective was message of food bringing people closer to each other. As the ad shows, a Chinese girl cooking very delicious biryani with the help of the recipe which comes along the biryani masala. And the later part of the video shows that a girl cooks biryani with enough perfection that everyone loves it. Which shows how helpful and detailed the recipes provided along the product are. Which also shows in the art that how how they can make a better relation between two nations, uh, specific uh, especially between Pakistan and China. The art shows a message of peace and and harmony. A positive for the society as a social aspect of the campaign was to deliver the message of sharing of food as one of the ways to bring people close to each other, e- even people from an entirely different country, culture, and dates. So through this ad, they show that it's not if you are a Chinese, uh, we don't believe in that. We also believe in. in other race other cultures so talking about the media strategy uh they they created 
uh, they created a video ad uh, with with the local and chinese cast uh, <clears throat> the uh, video was over 3 minutes long and they used um, tv channels as a short commercial as it was not possible to play the entire video on a tv channel because of the length of the video which was counted by uploading on the video uh, social platforms which the uploading of of the video on the social uh, networks mainly youtube allowed the viewership from around the with around the globe the message of the campaign could reach everywhere and uh, as uh, as my results will show that how the message was transferred to social platform next slide please so about the video about the video creation so they 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 casted uh, a chinese woman which uh, who makes a very good biryani and they have also shown two cities mainly lahore and karachi where the shoot took place next slide please uh, this is a screenshot i took from a video which shows the acceptance of a uh, outsider or you can say how we accept other religions other cultures and uh, they have shown that how uh, food can bring people much closer and how easy it is next slide please okay so uh, <clears throat> it is a part of media strategy that they chose um, very appropriate channels such as facebook youtube and and twitter and the choice of the time slot means that it was launched in 2017 during the holy month so i think that month is already a very a very peaceful which shows that uh, we can share food as well uh, with the concept of iftar next slide please now <clears throat> to the channel choices uh, the choice of the channel by shan foods to get the most from the campaign was tv commercial which was also shared later on the world's most popular video network youtube and other social media platforms such as facebook and twitter with the advertisement budget of shan foods limited in millions of rupees it was feasible for the company to opt for playing their ad on different tv channels operating in the country then i will be talking about the launching time of the video the holy month of Ram- of ramadan around the corner and the foreign re- relation with china on the stake is the context of cpac and other p- political tensions among world trade uh, giants shan foods not only chose to deliver a strong message but also took the right shot at the right time they also set up the food tables in lahore and karachi next slide okay measurement techniques global viewership and public opinion on social media which means that the impact of the campaign can be assessed with the viewership of the ad over different platforms and the public opinion through different channels such as people talking about the campaign over facebook and and twitter adaptability and culture change means another measurement technique to access the impact of the campaign will be the adaptability and the urge of at urge of acceptance of the social and economic change which china brings along with the cpac and the other measurement uh, technique was food sharing drive which happened over uh, facebook and other social media platforms and lastly a, a global awards and me- media's opinion the coverage of the video 
recorded by the media houses around the globe is another method to access the popularity of the campaign as they do not allow coverage for every other commercial ad unless something extra ordinary has happened <clears throat> next slide please ma'am results okay so the video ad won won the silver award in the fe awards in 2018 in the annual event of the fe awards in 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 singapore the win at the fe awards made the shan foods the first pakistani brand to achieve the milestone and the appreciation from the general public as a result of the campaign shan foods once again got a lot of appreciation from the general public for such as sentimental messages for the society people from both countries china and pakistan took the uh, social platforms both facebook and twitter to express their relations to the video ad it became a trending topic across the globe as cnn also aired the news of the popularity of the video and appreciation at the message conveyed in the video uh, which got shan foods uh, uh, popularity and might got the brand introduced with the western world where biryani is a foreign food item except among the pakistani and india expats next slide please yes uh, about the positive image in addition in addition to the people watching over the tv facebook and and twitter more than 200000 people watched the video over youtube only in very little time and this gained shan food a wide range of popularity and a positive brand image lastly strengthening of the diplomatic relation with china the, uh, the chinese uh, official also took a social media to appreciate to appreciate the idea of shan foods uh, the video sent a very positive message to the world about the positivity and acceptability of the pakistan community as is shown in the last part of the video when the chinese girl is appreciated uh, appreciated and the entire pakistani makes her feel like her own home next slide please uh, ma'am this is the video, uh, a picture of the award which this art campaign earned next slide please okay so the so the key learnings are significance of the brand image the advertisement campaign for shan foods private limited shows us that significance of the brand image and how it can be improved over time the main objective of the advertisement is not always to boost sales of the company such as in this case they are there are opportunities when the organization's main objective is to send a positive message to the society for paying for paying back to the community so the advantages of modernized media approach is if we would have been limited to just a tv commercial the campaign might not have been that successful the fact that video went viral over almost every social media website got the shan food the result which they might not even have expected these uh, were social media platform that not only save shan foods uh, probably uh, millions of rupees for not advertising on the social media platform themselves rather letting the people share it with the whole world uh, that's it ma'am thank you ji questions please no ma'am koshish kare questions puchne ki any questions about any part of the campaign no ma'am all right uh asan ji ma'am uh time slots kaun si thi ma'am ye time slots ka ye tha ki unhone ye uh, matlab ramzan mein unhone launch ki thi right uh okay do you fully understand what a time, what a time slot exactly means yes ma'am um, i know what it means uh, ye ye, ye uh, jo iske main ye uh, jo the uh, jo 
जो मुझे सिर्फ इसका ये एक ही टाइम स्लॉट का मुझे जो मैंने अपनी रिसर्च की थी वो ये पता चला था कि इफ्तार से बिल्कुल हाफ एन आवर ये पहले जब हर इंसान की टीवी के आगे मतलब ये बैठ जाता है ना ये उन्होंने were they not you using know. any other time slots apne i think you you mentioned iftar in your presentation as well so iftar can be identified as a you know like unki that was probably their prime time slot uh, any other time slot that they had selected was it not advertised any other time during the day in the month of ramadan nahi ma'am zyada focus in the iftar time tha kyunki us waqt har insaan ye matlab ye tv ke aage hota All right. Any idea how many times in during aftar time it was uh, released daily, and on which channels was it re- released? Ma'am, uh, information to me, I will not be able to give you because since our offices are closed. Uh, but I have done my own research. It was just that the first aftar was the first. It was very small. I mean, it was added at a very small level. Because the video was around uh, more than three minutes. So you think that uh, television release budget was not high, was it? Yes, ma'am. I do believe that. Uh, any idea what was the total budget of the campaign? No, ma'am. Ye, uh, this ka koi idea nahi tha. Okay. So did you get the information directly from Ogilvy, or did you da- uh, collect information online? Ma'am, I have done online because I have a friend who is in Ogilvy, but since offices are off. Hai, तो उसने कहा था कि मैं आपको ये डिटेल उस वक्त दे सकता हूं जब मतलब हमारा ये सब कुछ ये ओपन हो जाएगा ऑल राइट सो यू आर सेइंग दैट द द ओगिल्वी ऑफिस इज नॉट ऑपरेशनल एट प्रेजेंट राइट सिंस मैम ये मतलब कि जो ऐड था ये 2017 में था तो उनको अपनी वो फाइल्स में जाके इसकी पूरी एक वो फाइल निकालनी पड़ेगी फॉर मी All right. Okay. Fine. Uske ilawa, uh, can you explain and try explaining in English? What is uh, what do you exactly mean by adaptability and cultural change? Uh, ma'am, uh, by this I mean that uh, in Pakistan we all know that uh, that Chinese people are moving in in um, in a lot of numbers, right? So the adaptability means. for the chinese people that we are welcoming you you can be just like us um uh and the culture values we are showing over here is that uh, since um, pakistan is not known for a friendly c- country so through this ad uh, they were showing the acceptance of the cultures from all around the world All right. How did they assess the food sharing drive? Ma'am, the food sharing drive um, they access from the Twitter. As many people started to uh, like sharing the um, their tweets, like, "Mujhe aaj share share karne ko nahi mila." Shan Foods, like, is tarah ke the wahan pe. All right. Okay. Thank you. Uh, ji, any other question? Anyone? Thank you, Asim. Uh, okay. That was nice. That was a good presentation. Jee, Elena, how are you feeling today? I'm feeling good, ma'am. Okay, so hello, ma'am, and hello, everyone. Good afternoon. So it's me, Elena, and today I'll be presenting on Berger Paints Trucker Child Funder campaign. this campaign was done basically to help locate missing children in pakistan so ma'am next slide please uh ma'am your animations are so you have to you know uh, press the button keep pressing the button so as uh, since the issue is that every year there are over 3000 children that go missing in pakistan and uh, it's a huge issue when it comes to reporting and investig- investigating a missing child campaign and there are very few resources to locate these missing children in pakistan moreover it's even harder because the children are dispersed throughout the country to the remotest areas as quickly as they disappear so berger paints has succeeded in staying at the forefront of pakistan's paint industry in terms of quality and supplying the paint to the pakistan um, 
so the uh, basically the idea was to since to you know uh, fulfill its mission to act as a good corporate citizen enable them to come up with a unique campaign called trackart child finder the brand used the celebrated pakistani platform of trackart to paint missing children on trucks along with a helpline number given by the roshni foundation uh, ma'am aap aage okay ji so the uh, idea was to replace the portraits of uh, famous personalities on the back of the trucks that we usually see and uh, replace them with the portraits of missing children that are uh, dispersed throughout the pakistan next slide ma'am so this uh, ma'am next slide so this campaign was made in february 2019 and it was run in the same uh, month and year and it was done in collaboration with conceptual artist and anthropologist sama minalla khan and coordinated by roshni helpline foundation and it was filmed by saratin productions and it was handled by the acclaimed agency bbdo pakistan so the channel strategy was uh, the issue is that the traditional media doesn't reach to the remote areas where these children are dispersed so what does travel into these parts are good trucks are good trucks in remote areas of the country which is what makes this campaign highly effective in media innovation next slide next slide ma'am so and this campaign helped these trucks turning these trucks into moving billboards that gets the message to distant areas across the country as you can see here in these pictures as well all right i think you can actually point to the pictures and slay if you like you can talk about what is on the picture that would be helpful okay so ma'am uh, uh, the pictures are it's basically here the trucks are moving across the cities and across, uh, across the distant and uh, you know the uh, uh, remote areas of pakistan and it, on their backs the uh, pictures of missing children are, are painted So th- this is what these pictures are showing. Next slide, ma'am. So coming to the creative strategy, uh, cre- uh, strategy trucks are usually painted with actors, sports person, military chefs, florist patrons, politicians, animal slogans, and the idea was to replace these portraits uh, with uh, <coughs> with the portraits of missing children. <coughs> Excuse me, ma'am. In similar style with the helpline number given by Roshni Foundation. So as you can see here as well, yeah, that uh, Shahid Afridi is painted and Floral and some you know actor is painted on the back of the trucks and they were replaced with uh, the paintings of and portraits of missing children of Pakistan. Yes, ma'am. So as part of this uh, child finder campaign, and uh, this was done with conceptual artist and anthropologist, as I told before, who is known as you know using truck art for social change. and the these trucks were driven across pakistan including remote parts of the country where regular media coverage is almost non existent to help spread awareness about the campaign so when it comes to the measurements uh, the berger paints love on social media increased by over 70% and as compared to previous uh, shares through berger paints page before trucker child finder video this video's shares increased by 80% and the average shares per post previously versus this post was 1 ratio 10 <coughs> so moreover this campaign was several awards in the year 2019 at at stars 2019 which is an international advertising festival this campaign won two silver and eight bronze trophies in range of categories including design diverse insights and art direction craft Also, this uh, campaign won two Leah Silver Awards for the collaborative project with Sam uh, Samar Minallah Khan and Roshni Hussain. Also, this campaign uh, took the world by storm by picking up four Cannes Lion at the Cannes International Festival of Creativity: a silver lion in design, a silver lion in industry craft, a bronze lion in PR, and a bronze lion in direct. And this campaign also won. Um, a gold clio and silver clio at the 60th year awards this is one of only five gold awards uh, awarded to asia so uh, the campaign ma'am excuse me so the campaign uh, resulted um, Uh, the campaign uh, within the first week of this campaign, three hundred and thirteen calls were you know received uh, to uh, help you know to uh, investigate and report about a ch- uh, missing ch- uh, missing child, and <coughs> these trucks traveled across uh, Pakistan and while covering more than fifty thousand kilometer. Kiran, this the campaign hotline which was visible on the trucks has received over three <coughs> thousand. Excuse me, ma'am. 
3000 calls from more than 40 cities across the pakistan so people are now aware of where to report a missing child which has resulted in several leads and as a result of these leads uh, this campaign has helped find seven missing children uh, in pakistan so yeah so the key in learning is that it's not just about the aesthetics it was the idea of a billboard on wheels that brings so seamlessly into any local settings and it's the difference that uh, the campaigns should make so it's not always about ads or campaigns but the acts so any opportunity to the meaningful human rights cause will make a difference in the lives of people also the brand can f continue further continue this campaign in the coming years to help locate more missing children in pakistan which will you know increase the credibility and value of the brand Thank you, ma'am. That's it. Very nice. Very interesting presentation. Gee, anybody has questions about anything? No, ma'am. No, questions. No, ma'am. All right. So, Elena, uh, I would say okay, when you, you know, like uh, uh, what you can do, basically, I suggest more, most of the things you have covered. Uh, just tell me that channels, measurements, and uh, results, jo hai, uh, they are talking about the same things whenever you finalize your, your draft and past. So just, uh, just make sure that you are covering everything that is mentioned in channels is also uske results you have reported, and whatever you are reporting is also mentioned in channels. Okay, okay. thank you. Very good. If you have suggestions, I think you should try uh, at least. Ma'am, you suggestion they did the answer. I can understand that. Ma'am, I'm sorry to make two sick presentations. They came in. Mostly, ma'am. Yes. <laughs> Tell him that's, that's good. I, I think sharing is good. Good part is that you have presentations in the same different. Hai. What I like about Elena's presentation is that the visual work tha, that was very powerful. If you have noticed it, she uh, she created, you know, like track art ke design motifs ko use kiya for making her presentation. So I think it was visually very nice. Ji, ji yourself. Ji, miss. Uh, let me mark attendance of the first slot first. Abhi koi aisa to nahi hai jo reh gaya ya join nahi kar pa ra. Uh, baat hui hai aap logon ki kisi ne did anyone text you recently? Yes, ma'am. Hasib ko nahi. Hasib class join nahi kar pa ra. Hasib abhi bhi nahi join kar pa ra. Usko zara text karein ki attendance mark ho rahi hai aur usko naya link share karein. Ask him to uh, try joining the classroom now. I have a message in the group that I have been trying for a while now and I will share the link. I have a link share the link for 2-3 times. I have also shared it with you on WhatsApp. So I said that you can copy paste it and ask him to try using it. Okay? Let's go, I will do it again. Okay, Adnan Hashim. Ehsan Tahir. Elena. Arsal. Leo. जी असमा मैम प्रेजेंट सॉरी फैसल फैसल प्रेजेंट मैम हसीब प्रेजेंट मैम मदीहा प्रेजेंट जी मदीहा मोहम्मद हफीज प्रेजेंट मैम अमार यस मैम काजम प्रेजेंट मैम नॉरेज नॉरेज Zishan. Present, ma'am. Muzna. Ji, Muzna. Muzna is present. Rubab. Present. Sanya. Present. Saud. Sharfa. Present, ma'am. Or Shaheer. Ma'am, I don't know if he's getting messages in the group. Shumaila. Present, ma'am. Sundas. 
نوازش طوبا زہرا زہرا اینڈ زمرا میم زہرا یہیں تھی ابھی چلے میں نے ان دونوں کی تو لگا دی لیکن شہیر کس کی ایبسینٹ لگ گئی شہیر کی لگ گئی ایبسینٹ پرابلی اور نوازش ابھی تک آیا نہیں ہے آل رائٹ اوکے لیٹس گو بیک ٹو دس پریزنٹیشن جی جی ارسل ارسل کا مائک آف ارسل برو ہیلو پروڈکٹس Yeah, so for over 55 years, KNNs has remained true, true to its reason to exist of providing better nutrition through healthy and poultry, chick- healthy chicken and happiness of people and is now a favorite brand of millions of people in Pakistan. So the next is our communication strategy. So the context, first the context, where we are, where are we in line with our vision? to be the best FMCG company, emerging social media influencers as a new reference, health debate impacting on brands' perception, global agenda building on recycling issue. And the objectives what KNNs have are like protecting and enhancing our reputation, establish KNNs as a trusted advisor to the regulators, position KNNs as a regional powerhouse. Uh, next is road, uh, the roadmap of KNNs. How, will we, how, how, should they, how are they going to get there? So first, they have to build the trust with KOLs through key, key effective communications. Uh, KOLs are like key opinion leaders. So building trust with their key opinion leader, leaders through effective communications. And next is they have to be better aligned. They, have to, they, they must have a better aligned system stra- strategy. And then they should build the KNNs narrative internally and externally. And they, they must have the ability to influence this uh, uh, decision making by utilizing media. And the benefits of all of these activity is just increase trust with the straight stakeholders. Uh, next is uh, the image building campaign for KNNs, which I choose was the smart cooking app, which KNNs introduced in August 2018. and which created a boom in the market, to be very honest, because uh, in Pakistan, before that, there wasn't any such app through which you can cook and you know you can get easily recipes from there. Within a few minutes, you can prepare your meal. So the marketing program is founded on several pillars, including price, product, prom- promotion, place, packaging, etc. By physical evidence, we imply the three features, approachable, large organization, and multinational. The- main focus of this app was on the children the working women and those who is res- those who are residing in hostels and basically you know those who can't cook or do- doesn't know how to cook their meals so this was the best alternative that they could get to get to maybe eat a healthy meal within few minutes so the next is how insta- instead of amalgamating all these necessary contents the company released all in one app which amazing which offered amazing discounts offers and vouchers as well like if you if you are going to download the app you must get some sort of voucher and or like gift from the canons so that that was a great impact towards the customer the and the recipes introduced by the canons are based on smart cooking So you have to buy the product of Cadence and then you are going to download the app and then it's going to be very easy for you to cook anything you want you want to cook basically which men- and uh, the smart cooking app which manufactures products in ways such that they can be cooked instantly and easily making Cadence the optimal choice of consumers 
and delivery service and availability of all products among features are now offered in the app now you can also uh, you can also order your food like whatever you want to order from that app and then you are going to read the recipe and then you, then you are going to cook within few minutes like within no time the main uh, the main aim behind creating the app was to offer the convenience to the customer the only thing that that kenan kept in their mind while they were launching this app was only the convenience to the customers and that uh, actually created a really wow factor among customers and those who otherwise have to visit outlets to buy the products they wish to all right so the next is currently both android and ios versions of the apps are available on the respective stores because kenens is the only brand in pakistan which does offer this smart cooking app because uh, if you look for like if you are looking for the smart cooking app worldwide so there are only two apps which are operating one is hestin q and the second is cheflin and they both are work operating globally not for the not for only pakistan uh the next is the business and marketing objectives for this app or the cadence since the market uh, because since we all know the market is in ever evolving pattern recently resultantly working communities now struggle with possibilities for the meals which are you know the hygiene trend and the organic trend which is evolving in the market so this was the best alternative they could get for that in addition to requiring healthy alternatives for daily consumption they are also looking for these options to be cheaper alternatives to the ones currently available in the market so let's suppose if you're going to buy a meal for like 1000 or 1500 rupees from a restaurant so alternative to that kenens is offering you like 5 or 600 rupees box and you're going to cook at cook anything at your home like within no time the smart cooking app was made available in august 2018 that was the second quarter of the year and that was right before ramzan i guess and it has more than 50000 da- downloads surprisingly kenens stands out to be the sole manufacturer to launch an app and this above <clears throat> image in the, in the which i have shown like after this slide uh, shows the average reach made by the post over a time period until the quite recently and it analyzing effect had been a difficult task but these platforms are introducing no ma'am like i have shown a graph in the i guess seventh or eighth slide yeah so these platforms are introducing ever changing mechanisms that make them easy to use and uh, next is like uh, they should, they, they are going to they did invest in social media so the kenens is present on social media and like personal profiles have been made and used for the purpose of external communication and they were very clear on their social media footprints they introduced real time digital tools to enhance reach and have a better communication they like as you can see they are available on instagram facebook google twitter youtube like everywhere on the social media as well so the uh, setting kenens uh, so setting kenens food unified external world who was the last in the social media and the next is uh, their media engagement uh yeah so the me uh, like in media engagement uh, I, as you can see like i have mentioned below like it's q3 2018 and it's q4 2018 since i told like i to, as i told you before like the app was introduced in the second quarter of the year like q2 to 2018 and these are the activities which were done by kenens in q3 and q4 like third quarter of the year and fourth quarter of the year like after the launch of the app so after the after once they launched the apps they made sure like they should establish and build direct relationship with key media personnel and journalists so that the app must get a word, like a good word of mouth and then they uh, the key stakeholders were media house owner and print electronic media journalists because uh, social media is not only the place from where you can where, where they, they where they could market their app so it was it was evolving everywhere like on the print media as well like media houses and then the proposed outcome which uh, kenets was proposing like it was direct contact established with will, will allow journalists to reach out to kenets foods our team to verify any news before publishing it thus reducing the changes of bad or wrong publication of ba- uh, of any news against kenets foods pakistan so this was this was the proposed I- outcome and the next is key focus areas were like they should have a positive image building 
and leveraging the social media through bloggers and influencers. As I told you, like, this was not only the reason. And the next is measurements to measure the effectiveness of the campaign, the performance for your post tab specifically states people reached reactions, comments, and shares for the said posts. It also sh shows if any negative feedback received, which is shown by the number of people who hit posts or ended up by ended up reporting the age. So this is the graph which I which I was telling you before. Like it was the organic reach uh, within the first two or three days for that app. Like eventually that app was down, that, that app had like around fifty thousand downloads. But they, this was the reach when they you know then when they just created the app. And the next is key learnings. The learnings which I have come to come through this project was that the results exhibits that through uh, the, although Facebook interest does now not extensively affect income directly for the app campaign, it has an effect on the course to buy. So a, so a clean connection to sales can be observed. In addition to presenting deeper know-how to the fee of social media and an enterprise case for continued funding, the effects gave RB perception into how to use Facebook greater efficiently inside the market and blend consistent with the part of the course to purchase the campaign is asking to influence. So this evaluation suggests that every so often a slightly different method to dimension can provide gains with real, real, with realistic and robust results. I think that's applica applicable for everywhere. And in today's fast moving world, more people are found to be careful about the products they consume since, as I told you before, like people are going towards the hygienic and organic things. So everybody is conscious these days that uh, what are they going to eat in their meal, like in the next meal. So the, they prefer easy to use and quick to serve products in their meals. Since KNN has changed the dynamics wholly by launching the e-kitchen based store, the positive trend in results in prevalent is present prevalent. Thank you. G questions. Uh, no, ma'am. All right. Aap se mera ek question hai, Arsal. Why is it, uh, um, is, is this a corporate campaign or just uh, KNN's image building activities it says on the title? No, ma'am. Actually, I just, I just thought ke this was the image building campaign. This must be the image building campaign for the KNNs because the, uh, because the, the app which I have mentioned, it was only launched by KNNs and it was for the good of the customers. I, I was thinking you're talking about app, right? And you're also talking about yeah. e, e kitchen. So in that case, I think you need to you need to change title of the presentation. Just just go back and see, uh, you know, like where is your focus? Uh, because when you started presenting in the start, I was thinking that, you know, like looking at this part, uh, I wanted to know okay, why is it saying our communication strategy here? Uh, I mean, if you were actually working because, for, uh, for the client because, himself, no, you no, would no. go for our, but yeah. No, no, because I was, um, you know, I was mentioning myself as our communication strategy because I thought that I am, you know, introducing this app to the class or to you. So that's why maybe right, okay. I mentioned because, our, but uh, I'm going to update that. Yeah. So uh, that's uh, that's fine. I just, I was, um, I'm only suggesting that you try changing the title because uh, you were talking about eKitchen and, uh, and a specific app. So probably the title should actually focus on that. And you, know, Baki, you can look at uh, the samples in Google Classroom and see how titles are framed. So you can you need to change, uh, make slight changes to sure, the title. Sure. Right. When I when, when you were presenting this part, I thought sure. okay, it's too broad uh, in the sense that you were talking about uh, KNN, right. right? You were not talking about a specific product of KNN. You were not talking about yes, the seek kebab or <laughs> thunder fillet or yeah. you know like nuggets, etc. You were talking about uh, any other product of KNN. So basically, uh, by this, brand. Uh, you, huh, you were not talking yeah. about a specific brand. So that's why I'm asking that it was a corporate campaign. It sounded like a corporate campaign because you were talking about everything. And uh, then you started talking about uh, a particular app and also eKitchen. So I thought, uh, you know, like uh, you may need to make slight changes here and there. So everything focuses on that particular eKitchen and particular uh, app, app, right? 
So we can say that your uh, case study is about that particular sure. app and eKitchen, right? Uh, sure. You understand? I'm suggesting okay, for your uh, for your case study, you focus on G just, G just G the G app and eKitchen, e e okay? Just the app and eKitchen, sure, right? For the final sure. version, just the app and eKitchen. It sounds like a, it looks like a good no, presentation, no. but for the final, just focus on those two elements, okay? Done. Okay. Done. Done. All right. Thank, Thank you. you. Anybody, any question? Thank you. Yeah. No question? Hai? No question. All right. It was a good presentation. Thank you. Um, Thank you, Miss. Thank you. Uh, Asma? Yes, ma'am. Are you ready? Uh, apparently. <laughs> <laughs> Should I start? Didi, you can start. Yeah. Okay, uh, so the topic of my presentation is Hali Food Transform Its Brand Identity. That was in year 2017. Uh, so come into the marketing context. Hali Foods Limited, previously Chaudhi Dairy Limited, is one of the prestigious brands in Pakistan since 1984. Hali Milk was one of the first product launched in it, uh, by uh, which was its USP, the thickest milk. From being the pioneer of dairy industries in Pakistan to be the market leader of ultra high treatment USG milk, Halib market share started fluctuating after 2006. Uh, the drift was due to aggressive marketing from the Nestle milk pack, uh, followed by Allbirds. They did multiple efforts to regain, uh, regain their market position by introducing new brand Grow Or, uh, that's another drinking milk in 2017, and other brands like Dairy Queen. By 2017, Halib milk market share dropped uh, to 2%. In this year, uh, they took another plunge and unveiled new corporate logo and website. As a part of company's investment in customer-focused digital channels, Halib revamp website uh, was a long-term initiative that would help consumer to navigate through the entire portfolio of Halib brands. Since then, their entire marketing and sale has been through digital media, for example, Facebook, Instagram, and other websites. Uh, their business and marketing objectives were, uh, new marketing strategies follows with the aim brand recall and improve its image as the brand already existed. The objectives were to promote the brand as much as possible as it had been away from the limelight since long. The role of communication was to position Halib Food as an up-to-date company with new launch of brand like Flava, that's a flavored milk. Research in uncovered that market share had already been divided between Nestle and Anglo Foods. Halib Food had to give the user website interface experience so that they could attract the maximum audience. Rather than relying on any specific PR and promotional campaign, uh, they were looking to measure the effect effectiveness of each part across the 12 months. That's the whole year. Uh, so this was their website uh, outlook, which they introduced. Uh, channel choice and target audience. Consumer of dairy and related products are usually of all age groups apart from infants, uh, which usually uh, start off at one go. Uh, however, the company has... Yes, ma'am. Sorry, I'm interrupting. I just want to know, ki aapka kaun sa slide hai? is it slide four or five? Uh, five. Right, okay, thank you. Yeah, no problem. Uh, so I was telling you the channel choice and target audience. Uh, since dairy and dairy products are used by uh, every age group, apart from people who are lactose intolerant or uh, the infants. Uh, however, the company had to target people who were internet user in specific as they wanted them to visit their website. In addition to that, they collaborated with different events uh, to achieve their goal. They used conventional medium like TV and radio as well. Lexus and open stall and university events were also a part of their channel. Uh, the target audience in general includes 20 years old male and female since they are the one who usually purchase milk for the daily use. The customer to be, uh, go, uh, these are the customers which usually go to the grocery store or buy it out online from the website. And next slide, please. Uh, the creative strategy uh, started off with uh, many campaigns which was uh, also, Halib is safe, actually. They wanted to reassure in the minds of uh, the consumer that Halib is a safe milk. Uh, they uh, endorsed uh, Zeva Bakhtayar uh, for this campaign as well. Uh, they also did uh, um, 
a um, uh, collaboration with a oh, partner with the Specbel Me3 in order to gain maximum mileage on their digital platform. A Facebook campaign was launched, contests were conducted, and free uh, tickets were given as a reward, hence managing to grab the attention of 15,000 fans. Um, and about the Zewa Star campaign, uh, the uh, milk credibility and safety was actually promoted through this campaign. There were two TVC testimonials by her uh, in which uh, the consumer were redirected to what uh, Halib's basic aim was uh, to provide milk which is safe. Uh, uh, there was a Ramadan special edition pack uh, which uh, with price reduction. A BTL marketing campaign was launched to support this new price point and packaging. The song Kun Kun, Kun rights were bought for it, um, and uh, with and this campaign actually uh, was very much uh, famous on YouTube and Facebook, and it was over five fifty five thousand uh, view, uh, views were. Uh, can could be seen uh, through this campaign. Uh, they also participated uh, in Ramzan Bazaar for the first time in the year. Uh, and the aim of that activity was to create brand awareness, capitalize the market potential, and maximize uh, maximize sales of Halif products. Uh, other types of trials and engaging activities they initiated in 2017 was Mother Day Context, Champion Trophy Contest. Uh, mosque and hotel of Tar activity. That year, uh, they also sponsored NCA Welcome Festival uh, and Ravel Expo Center as an effort to interact with potential consumer and educate them on their products. Uh, the results and benefits, not only had the followers on social media increased to about 1,500 with every campaign, sales increased to 60% since quarter of 2017. Uh, flour that was their favorite milk also uh, achieved more than 100% of its volume target in the first uh, initial phase. Uh, the website landing of cost, uh, customers went considerably uh, noticed. They managed to fill in their losses from previous years and on page that year was a successful run for them. Uh, key learning. The result shows that people can be persuaded to good again, provided the quality is maintained showed uh, that sometimes it is necessary, uh, necessary to try multiple things so that the brand recall stays in people's mind. Since the brand realized that digital medium was a better option to promote their business and to conduct the sale, as well as uh, uh, they continued to run new campaign on their social media pages, that is Facebook and Instagram, their product purchasing channel has shifted to websites like the Raz. Thank you, ma'am. Okay, thank you. Welcome. Gee, questions? No, ma'am. All right. Asma, uh, uh, yes, are you sure all of the channels that you have talked about mentioned here? Dinke, the channels uh, that uh, whose results you reported? Uh, yes, ma'am. I did uh, mention the flexors and the TV and the... Um, uh, like most of them I have, I will go through again. If I've missed any and I'll add an up. All right. Okay. Yep. All right. Thank you. Good presentation. Thank you. Thank you, you ma'am. Gee, Faisal, are you here? Yes, ma'am. Ma'am, it's a wall of जो आपने जो आपने हमें फीडबैक दिए प्रेजेंटेशंस में तो हमने मिड टर्म के लिए तो प्रेजेंटेशंस नहीं देनी ना प्रेजेंटेशंस वुड बी मार्क्ड आई विल नीड पेपर्स फॉर यू नो लाइक फाइनल ड्राफ्ट ऑफ पेपर्स फॉर द मिड टर्म सो इट्स एक्सट्रीमली इंपॉर्टेंट कि आप यू इंप्रूव इट एज मच एज यू कैन ठीक है ठीक है लेकिन आपको ये आपको ये पावर पॉइंट तो नहीं चाहिए ना अब दोबारा नहीं नहीं पाव आई वुंट नीड द पावर पॉइंट अगेन आई विल जस्ट नीड अ पेपर submitted you know like this originally you were uh, submitting papers with properly designed uh, in properly designed format and text uh, improve the text as much as you can theek hai 
Now, one more question. Uh, uh, we just want to ask the uh, feedback you've already given uh, on our previous draft. We will do all of it and then you will give a like page there. Because since you said that the presentation you made the previous one and then and then improve it. So, today you have given the feedback. We will do all of it and then you will give it to you and then you will submit it. Right? Yes. Some of the students improved their uh, presentations on the basis of the feedback given earlier. So some of them I understand have have only used their earlier drafts for making the PowerPoint presentation. So I, I suggest ke for, for the midterm uh, suggestion meri yehi hai ke aap log, uh, maximum, uh, you know, I have given you feedback twice. I've given you feedback on your presentations and I've given you feedback on your first draft of papers. So for midterm, I only suggest ke dono feedback ko dekhe and make your best, whatever best you can do. Uh, incorporate kar lein for, for writing your final draft of the case study. Okay, okay. thank you. Okay, very nice. G. G. Faisal. Assalamualaikum, uh, everyone. Uh, so, I'll be presenting on uh, on the stick and the topic that I, uh, that I chose is local FMCG brand uses social media to make their brand uh, actually a household name. So, let's talk about the market context. Next slide. So actually, Dasta Cooking Oil is actually a product of uh, Unity Food, which is launched in 2018. Uh, the brand main focus is to get recognition as it is a new brand in a high, uh, and they are uh, competing with the uh, com competing in a market where where our giants like Sufi Dal and Kashmir Cooking Oil actually exists. So as a new entrant, the main challenge for Dasta is to create awareness. Ma'am, abhi piche. So create awareness about their product. So if we talk about the target market, uh, next man. Next. So if we talk about the target market, so the primary target audience that uh, the stick has is housewives age 25 and above, and the secondary target market it's male that were a, a, a age of uh, 35 uh, uh, and above. So the communication objective of Dastik was to make people recall their brand uh, uh, whenever they are purchasing cooking oil. Uh, so let's talk about the business objectives. So a new marketing strategy should be devised aiming to generating awareness about Dastik cooking oil. Because if, if we're talking about an uh, edible oil category, uh, People do, if people do not recall the stick that it exists, they will they will not purchase it. And as a new entry in the market, the stick could not uh, couldn't compete uh, uh, compete in terms of distribution and supply chain. So the only way to uh, which they can compete was to generate sales through sales promotion, which is not so good for all of our sales value. So what brand need actually is a pull promotion strategy in which customer demand the product from retailers. The stick need to give people a reason to buy their product. So they launched their first CVC in which uh, in which they targeted the uh, targeted the young girl, and they want to position themselves right in the subconscious mind of the consumer. But uh, on the World Food Day 2019, Dastak actually launches a social media campaign in which they focus on or reducing the food waste by using the hashtag slip, uh, split the plate. So uh, let's come to the channel choice. So actually, Facebook was uh, used as a communication. Please, thoda se, can you try explaining what this idea split the plate means? Ma'am, uh, I'll, I'll explain in the creative strategy. Okay, good. Okay. Okay, so Facebook was used as a communication medium to run this campaign. And the reason behind using Facebook is that brands want to engage with their consumers. They want their consumer to react and share their social cause. They also want to take advantage of trending hashtag on World Food Day. So. If we talk about the creative strategy, so the whole idea was to connect with the consumer and grab their attention and also to give them a reason to choose the stick over other brands. And for that purpose, they use this cause marketing strategy. And what a cause marketing strategy is, is actually a brand uh, apply a dual marketing strategy in which the purpose is to increase the profitability and also, uh, also uh, doing something better for the society. 
And uh, the reason behind the use is cost marketing strategy is because a global study shows that 91 percent of the millennial consumers said that they would likely switch to a brand that supports the good cause for no change in price of the quality. And if we talk about the com campaign specifically, split the plate idea, it's actually an idea that can be understood anywhere in the world with the aid of the aid of the language, because uh, it it is actually showing us that they consume less. Uh, con consume less, which really shows that the brand care for the cause and it also make it clutter breaking. So, uh, Maya means, ma'am, although it is very difficult to measure the social media, uh, social media campaign for the FMC brand because there are a lot of other things going on like promotional campaign and or TVC's advertisement. But in, if we specifically talk about this, so at that time, no advertisement campaign was running. So the effectiveness of this campaign can be measured by the engagement rate of consumers. So the more, and that's what actually this campaign meant to be to uh, uh, to uh, to engage with the consumers. So the more consumer engage with it, the larger impact it has on sales. So actually, the campaign has actually three million plus view on Facebook. And if we if we measure the campaign engagement rate through reach, so it has re, uh, it has reached to ten point five percent, which is a huge number. And normally brand uh, normally campaigns have a engagement rate of around uh, three to four five four to five percent. But the uh, but this really shows that the campaign hits. And if we talk about the engagement rate by views, then five point five percent of the people reacted on. Uh, on on Facebook while viewing, the, uh, viewing this campaign. So this ad is also listed as a top five ad by Aurora. Uh, next one. So the result actually clear, clearly shows us the power of the advertisement. With the right content delivered at the right time can really make a difference and lift brand love and sales. Thank you. Any questions? No, ma'am. All right, uh, Faisal, apne, yahan pe you are saying that uh, uh, it's difficult to measure the effectiveness of social media campaign, right? Yes, ma'am. While here you are reporting results of social media campaign. Yes, ma'am. Right? So, and actually, I'm, I'm, I'm talking about uh, in measurements, the results, uh, the sales impact, because we cannot uh, calculate the total sales impact on just because of the social media campaign. That's what I'm talking about. Uh, was cooking oil their first product they launched in the market? Yes. Uh, and you uh, and all these results are actually about the cooking oil campaign. Uh, yes, ma'am. It's actually about the, that's the cooking oil. That's the cooking oil. So uh, why does it not say that's the cooking oil here? Uh, Ma'am, I'll edit it. Are all of these images about the that's the cooking oil? These are different uh, packings of the cooking oil, right? And uh, no, it looks like Banaspati in the middle. And the other three, these three, these two here and the one uh, on the left side and two on the right side look like cooking oil packings, right? Yes, ma'am. Right? So you need to think that uh, if this case study is about Dastak cooking oil in particular, because FMCG brand, uh, Dastak, jo hai, usko it looks like ke aap, uh, you are talking about launch of a, of a few different products at the start, while most of the presentation actually talks about Dastak cooking oil, right? So. Uh, I think uh, okay, just focus on the, the cooking oil, how it was launched and uh, make sure that uh, from uh, from beginning to end, you are talking about how the, the cooking oil was launched. Right. Or, okay. uh, and, uh, you know, on the on this on the right side, you have I can understand this is um, probably a downloaded image. But when you start discussing measurements here and uh, start discussing results here just try to see how the measurements were reported in the case studies we were looking at i think we were looking at graphs in various case studies we, we discussed in classroom right 
and uh, try to see if you can create a graph for measurements and uh, results for measurements. So I would suggest that while writing your final draft, just consult some of the case studies uploaded in Google Classroom and improve it as much as you can. Okay? Yes, okay. All right. Good presentation. Thank you. Here, you have said the top five TVCs of 2019. Right, so I can understand that they were posting TVCs on uh, social media, were they? Uh, Ma'am, it's actually on uh, it a social media campaign. The rest the news channel ne, like wo earned media tha, actually, which the news channel ne is campaign ko uh, news me like bataya tha, ye viral thi tha. Viral tha. So I would suggest that in while writing your final draft, if you can talk about you know a bit of earned media and other form of media, jo bhi hai, just usko make it better. Uh, I think it's quite it's good at present, but make it better. ठीक है? Okay. So okay, thank you. Ji Hasib. Yes, ma'am. All right. मैम अगर ऐसा हो जाए कि किसी ने एक पे की और दूसरे क्लासमेट ने भी उसी पे कर ली हो तो कोई इशू तो नहीं है ना? I think there were only two people. This पे दस तक पे there were two presentations, but there is some difference. So your your content, your essays should be very different from each other, basically. दस तक की I know कि there were two presentations. गुलामत की there was only one presentation. दस तक की both presentations were different from each other. So uh, that's why मैंने उनको अभी तक कुछ कहा नहीं. I did ask them why why they have similar topics. What I'll do, I'll post everybody's topic in Google Classroom, right? And I will also check के किसकी presentation मुझे पहले receive हुई थी. Okay? So for the final, uh, आप लोगों को uh, uh, you have to assure कि आपकी कोई किसी किस्म की similarity नहीं है. दस तक के लोगों से I have I have no problem. जी. Miss, मेरा question है कि अगर हमने जो ये आप basically जो changes आपने गए थे उसके हिसाब से हमने resubmit की थी तो उसकी submission date पर change हो जाती है ना? जैसे कैसे आप evaluate करेंगे कि किसकी पहले आई थी या किसकी बाद में आई थी? मैम आपने पहले नहीं बताया था कि रिपीट नहीं हो सकती अब हमें तो नहीं पता था रिपीट हो ये तो देखें ना वो हमें फिर पूरी एक प्रेजेंटेशन फिर से बनानी पड़ेगी और सारा वो फिर से करना पड़ेगा मैं तो इस चीज के बारे में पहले नाम बताएं मैं सीब अभी तो सीब और दूसरी किसकी है गुलामत पे all right, I will see both presentations, dekhungi, but I am telling you that your content hai, it cannot be similar. I already said that the I have seen both presentations, dekhi thi, they were way different from each other. So that's why I did not say anything to the two students. Ma'am, look, you gave me the first feedback, so I didn't feel good at all. So I rejected it from my own side, so I prepared a case study. Okay, Norris, what is your name? Norris, 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 you have to retain your first topic, please. Who is your name? I can see that you have to retain your first topic. You can speak to me separately. Ma'am, the content will be both different, obviously, we have not made it together. अच्छा हम अभी उसको डिस्कस नहीं कर सकते ना आई हैव टू सी सी योर वर्क टू कमेंट आई सेड ये तो प्रेजिंग करनी है आई सेड के दस तक का दस तक की दो दो सबमिशंस थी एंड दे वर वे डिफरेंट फ्रॉम इच अदर सो दैट्स द रीजन आई ओनली आस्क देम बाय देयर टॉपिक्स आर सिमिलर बिकॉज़ आई थॉट कि उनकी में सिमिलरिटी � Right? Dono ke kaam mein fark tha. So that's why I did not say anything to, to the two students. Ab jo jahaan tak Norris ka hai aur Haseeb ka. Uh, let's see yeah. Haseeb's presentation. I would, I would look at Norris work. Norris, you may have to change yours probably the third time. Aapka, I have to look at your work to give you a comment ke aap usko kya karenge, theek hai? Uh, we can't continue discussing this issue right now. I have to see your work in Google Classroom. I'll look at assignment one, I'll look at presentations, and then I'll tell you what to do. Okay? 
Okay, Haseeb, uh, I think you should start your presentation. Okay, miss. Uh, so basically, my presentation is on Golamid. Uh, just going through a brief history of Golamid is it's a textile mill which was founded in on actually today, April 1st, 1953. Uh, they sell clothing and their retail stores are called uh, Ideas through uh, by Golamid. There are 40, uh, 40 retail stores. So basically, their ca campaign was May Perfect, which uh, was uh, basically showing how, uh, you know, uh, uh, basically, they're focusing on uh, different issues in society and how uh, women overcome those issues, particularly women in this. Uh, all the imperfections or all the problems that people current, uh, deal with on a day-to-day -day basis, and then they have to move forward with that. So they were trying to make uh, people comfortable with this concept of, of being comfortable with your imper uh, imperfections. Uh, next slide, please. So this this was a new concept because uh, basically Joe, um, actually, sorry, this was a new concept for Golemid or anyone in the particular industry because uh, basically in the past they only had ads which uh, showed okay they have a new lawn conduct, uh, collection and people are dancing and everything. So basically this focused on a completely new way of presenting their lawn because uh, or their spring collection because it focused on actual issues in the society, but generated a lot of attention to people because it was a new concept. People weren't used to this. They actually discussed, you know, in, in, the, uh, uh, in the video or the TVC, there's a girl who's talking about her hair and she's not comfortable with her hair, but she'll, she's still getting ready and getting dressed and going out, or there's someone who's not comfortable with their skin tone or all the issues that uh, people currently face in Pakistan or being too dark or being too tall, being too short or anything like that. So basically their whole concept was to uh, create awareness on this issue and then therefore uh, uh, obviously lead to sales and attract, mainly attract attention. So their campaign attracts attention and then people start talking about climate, which did happen. Uh, their channel choice, next slide. The channel choice was uh, basically they had a TVC and uh, social media posts and uh, social media they weren't that active on it but uh, as compared to uh, uh, the TVC and also the posters and billboards that they ended up launching. Next. So yeah, their creative strategy was uh, um, uh, as I mentioned before that you know they were looking beyond the traditional views and uh, how to go about it. People still complain within these ads that they use models even to show their imperfections, but uh, they just wanted to show within, within this ad that, okay, even models or even people that, uh, models who are perceived in public as to be perfect or beautiful, even they deal with imperfections and even they go through certain things like that. Um, one more thing in the previous slide. So this this particular ad focuses on the golden compass theory, which shows that companies, uh, which which shows that people don't buy the products based on like what the companies do, but why they do it. So there has to be a strong message behind the company. The so basically, um, uh, their their main focus was on why they do it. So uh, they use this concept to uh, put out an image or put out a ad in the market or uh, a campaign basically to show the theory or to show the concept behind Golamid instead of just, just presenting clothes and you know they wanted to focus more on the societal issues. Uh, this campaign appealed to a wide audience and was repetitive on all kinds of uh, social, on all kinds of different channels. The main thing that I want to talk about is on YouTube, uh, a, a company called 7 Ad posted it and it used, uh, reached about 243,000 views is very high for this campaign and uh, therefore I think the campaign was successful and as it generated a different type of message and uh, had engagements. Thank you. Do you have questions? No, ma'am. No, ma'am. Ma'am, after that, we'll take the raise and then we'll ask आप ये कह रहे हैं कि इसकी और नॉरेस की एक जैसी है इसलिए उसकी प्रेजेंटेशन ले लूँ ऐसा नहीं और फैसल की भी घटी है नहीं जैसी नहीं है काफी डिफरेंस है 
फेसबुक ट्विटर एक्सेट्रा and see ke how it behaves theek hai so i think it would be interesting to see some some of these uh, in that form or uh, i hope ke yahan pe uh, it says posters billboards also so in comes or in, in terms of uh, measurements and results i think you just need to add uh, के बिलबोर्ड बीच पोस्टर्स रीच एक्सेट्रा अगर इफ यू कैन फाइंड समथिंग राइट सम ऑफ यू वर टॉकिंग अबाउट यू नो लाइक कुछ लोगों में से आपने से मेंशन सॉफ्ट सॉफ्ट न्यूज़ यू नो लाइक सोशल सोशल मीडिया से कैंपेन बिकेम वायरल एंड न्यूज़पेपर्स एंड अदर मैगजीन स्टार्टेड रिपोर्टिंग अबाउट इट सो आई थिंक इफ यू हैव एनी फिगर्स अबाउट दैट आल्सो तो उसको भी इंक्लूड कर लें व्हाट फर्दर गेंस द कैंपेन अचीव्ड ठीक है Okay. All right. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, Madhya, are you here? Yeah, ma'am. All right, Jean. Um, my presentation is about uh, breast cancer. Uh, we will identify. Uh, I mean, how many women got awareness from digital media about breast cancer self screening? So the sponsors uh, of this coming month, mark I can see the whole page. Yeah, the sponsor were Allied Bank. I mean the back uh, page, the last one. Yeah, the sponsors of this campaign was uh, Allied Bank, Festival Bank, Total, and Rose Petal, and packages and many more. So to next move to the next uh, slide. Okay, executive summary of this uh, campaign is uh, October is uh, marked as a uh, Breast Cancer Awareness Month in Pakistan and uh, all over the world. Uh, and in this month, uh, uh, many organizations and uh, governments try to increase attention and encouragement. Mm. Should I start? Very. Okay. so october is marked as the breast cancer awareness month all over the world and uh, government and many health organization try to increase attention towards encouragement of the awareness <coughs> and early detection and treatment as well as calming of the disease breast cancer is the most common disease overall the world among women and in the it is the second highest uh, reason of the death but uh, i mean uh, for the women i mean who are suffering with cancer so the the health organizations uh, feel that if we examine uh, and we do self screening on time it can reduce the risk of death we can we move to the next uh, slide okay market context of this uh, campaign and objective is uh, the shaukat khanum hospital launched this campaign and he is making good efforts to aware about uh, cancer disease specifically if we talk about this campaign this is about breast cancer and uh, the breast cancer overall in pakistan uh, it is estimated that uh, each year more than 83000 cases of the breast cancer are reported in pakistan nearly 40000 women die due to uh, this uh, fatal disease Uh, early breast cancer detection can help to start time appropriate uh, treatment in pakistan one out of nine women are expected to suffer from the disease at any point in their life and about 77% of aggressive breast cancer occurred in women 50 years old age but if diagnosed early survival rate can approach 90% this is breast cancer can prevented in one third of the women if routine mammography is done in women over 50 years years old age uh, they for a short 
breast examination can prevent this cancer and protect women from the most horrifying and horrifying disease uh, campaign uh, objective was to make women conscious about their health and remind them to spare 5 minutes can save their life for, from a big loss um, next slide so insight of the end strategy of this campaign was creative we was to create awareness among ladies to self examination for uh, take initial check up from a doctor if there is any sign visible related to breast cancer insight was based on the social and health influences uh, in pakistan because of conservative and religious beliefs ladies hesitate to talk about breast cancer publicly and result increased mortality in the uh, pakistan Furthermore, women are reluctant to go to the male doctors for an opinion. And the second reason was information on breast cancer and incompetent health care system. Self-examination not only can help early diagnosis and less expensive treatment, also increase the chances of survival. On the parallel, it helps to empower women. Campaign was categorized to make women conscious and aware about breast cancer, either she is housewife or work working lady okay the creative media implementations was the slogan of the campaign was to chalo aaj se irada kare 5 minutes apne naam kare basically they have supported the 5 minutes for the self examination in daily routine uh, every sector of the women can uh, spare 5 minutes uh, every day to self examine their uh, uh, breast cancer signs Uh, five minutes for campaign launch on TV, radio, and every other social web channel, Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, and YouTube. All communication mediums are uh, in reach to all kind of uh, social setups. They arrange many female-oriented morning and talk shows for the specific awareness. Five minutes for me. Cast of the campaign was famous, highly paid models and actresses of the past. Uh, through this. Uh, uh, Though they have played TVC on all big channels, on the parallel they equally emphasized on the digital channels. Next slide, please. Okay, uh, there are some activities uh, they have done uh, related to this uh, specific campaign. The TV uh, on TV they have launched 60 to 30 second TVCs. On website they have created e-pamphlet in Urdu and English. TVCs and social media links are available on. on uh, shokat khanum website in the social media presence on instagram facebook and twitter and printed materials they also distributed in uh, every school and uh, in every health uh, related places and they have conducted many seminars in schools colleges and universities and um, some pr activities like they have arranged uh, they have uh, created a pink tea party and group of uh, they have suggested many people that they can uh, arrange pink tea parties at their own and as a host they can uh, call people and colleagues to aware this uh, about this social cause and uh, people can post their uh, uh, photos on uh, instagram hashtag with the pink tea and uh, they can get uh, kits containing breast cancer information material and youtube they have uh, shokat khan and they have their own channel they have uh, uploaded this video on uh, uh, shokat khan and too in the next slide okay these are the visuals they have created for this uh, campaign uh, they took i mean uh, screen is not clear because of maybe internet okay There are some visuals. I mean, there are some pamphlet photos and uh, pink tea party invitation card, and there are some uh, press ads and uh, banners which were used on the website and other channels. In next video, okay. Here are some uh, screenshots of the uh, social media ch channels like YouTube, Instagram, and Twitter. we can read uh, the next uh, exact figures of the followership on next slide i guess this is repeating can we move to the next slide okay 
uh, if we calculate overall impact of the awareness specifically digital campaign through the number of followers likes and subscription individually like on uh, instagram uh, they have 148k followers and facebook they have uh, almost 42 uh, i don't know what is the it is like in lakhs i mean of course it is 428k something like this and uh, on twitter they had 224.5k followers and on channel they have 7.51 subscription and uh, specifically if we talk about this tvc uh, which is related to this campaign they have almost they, they were two or three links and they have many uh, different uh, numbers of the viewership uh so what i have said that was the biggest on uh, 492 views for this video and um, specifically on uh, youtube otherwise they have uh, this link on instagram obviously uh, okay okay results the core objective of the campaign was to give knowledge about the breast cancer and other side make uh, on the other side like make ladies conscious about self screening which can help facing big uh, health risk against negligence to me the outcome of 5 uh, minutes uh, for me uh, success for the breast cancer knowledge and attitude is in terms of early breast cancer detection this uh, this is imaginative survey from the different hospitals and medical centers reports of the biopsy proven stage 1 breast cancer patient from the stage 1 breast cancer patient were calculated in all age groups in absolutely numbers and it percentage the total number of uh, women aged below 40 years aged one patient wa were calculated there was a slow trend towards improvement in early diagnosis of the breast cancer which increased by the time okay the learnings uh, what we learned the results which we got from the social uh, web channels uh, are obvious that uh, web oriented knowledge is more fast, fast and big in numbers to get uh, followed through instagram facebook women can get direct knowledge about self examination with privacy so social media works better than print or television that is it ma'am ji questions नो मैम मैम सिर्फ एक क्वेश्चन तो रहते हैं फ्रेंड जी अस्मान मैम एक्चुअली जस्ट वांट टू आस्क कि वी कुड वी हैव टेकन दिस काइंड ऑफ केस स्टडी लाइक कि ब्रेस्ट कैंसर के तौर पे देयर इज नो ब्रांड ब्रांड एक्चुअली व्हाट डू यू मीन as in like breast cancer was a cause right and there was no brand since you are uh, since a case study was behind excuse me sir behind this uh, it's, campaign it's, i mean it's, it's a campaign ji madhiha please try answering ji yeah because they uh, through this campaign they have created awareness and they when they have created many uh, seminars and conferences and they uh, Uh, I mean, created no, that. Uh, Madhya, I get it. I just wanted to ask: Is there, uh, is there a brand which initiated this, uh, like breast cancer, wala? Or is this initiated by government? Yeah, that's what. No, I this was. is this is created by Shaukat Khanum. I have mentioned that this is this campaign oh. is from uh, okay. Shaukat Khanum, okay. and because because of this campaign, they have generated many uh, financial funds. Uh, on, on the uh, front page, uh, it was not mentioned. Now, Shaukat Khanum, that's the only thing which was confusing. Because every other thing was sponsored. I guess I have added yeah. in three places that Shaukat Khanum have take initiative to avail. चलो आज से इरादा करें टाइप ऑफ थिंग्स यू नो अगर हम इसको इसके साथ कनेक्ट कर रहे हैं शौकत खान बेसिकली द मेन ऑब्जेक्टिव इज टू अवेयर पीपल 
और उसके साथ पैरल जो होता है शौकत खान हम अपने फंड वगैरह क्रिएट कर रहा होता है बेसिकली I have a question for you. You are saying sponsored yeah. by Rose Petal, uh, K Ross Future, uh, Telenor, Sapphire, Total, Allied Bank, Faisal Bank, Jubilee, and so many other things. You know. So uh, in yeah. your in your presentation, you haven't mentioned any of the collaborations. So because uh, they haven't. I mean, in form of financial funds, they have uh, sponsored to this uh, specific cause. Otherwise, they have never uh, they have never mentioned anything related to this sponsor. That's what they have done no, specifically. No, no, no. This is the reason. No, if 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 this campaign was not run in collaboration with all of these people, why do they appear on slide one, number one, right? If they are not collaborating, they should not appear here. If they have collaborated, then then you must say what Shaukat Khanam or the ad agency would. Which ad agency did this? I mean, I don't know because they have their in-house setup. I mean, mostly they work from, uh, I mean, their own channels. All right. So you are saying Shaukat Khanam. You are saying Shaukat yeah. Khanam no longer has an ad agency. Is that what you are saying? Most of the time, they don't go to the ad agencies. I mean, in beginning, they were uh, I working know, with ad agencies. I, I know they have in-house setup also because uh, one yeah. of one of our Uh, you know, uh, T uh, TFT head is head of Shaukat Khanam Media Wing at present, right? So yeah. basically, what I'm asking that th that title page does say uh, breast cancer self screening, right? Uh, it yeah. should, it should also say it says how many women got awareness from digital media about breast yeah. cancer self screening, right? So when yeah. when you go to you know like there is a page that actually gives detail of activities, right? You see activity yeah. detail here, so these yeah. these uh, this is not just digital media activities are actually more than what you what we see on the title. See, you can see printed material here, you can see seminars here, and then you are seeing uh, a few other things. So some of these mm -hmm. things actually do not come under the heading of digital media, right? Uh, yeah, because uh, I have just give an overview that they are present on many uh, other channels, but I have totally give the number of followership uh, only of on right, digital media. All right, I understand that. What I am saying, that as you have mentioned, Shaukat Khanam, chalo irada kare self examination. So the title needs to uh, change accordingly. Also, all of these, okay. uh, all of these uh, organizations that or partners that you have mentioned here, you have to clearly mention their role in this campaign because if they appear on this page, then they are definitely partners in partners in some way or the other. So, uh, some certain parts of the of the case study need write, rewriting in terms of mention, okay. mentioning clearly mentioning the role of all of these partners that appear on the on the title page because. Okay. Uh, if you if you remember, we have discussed case studies in classroom that actually say by by an organization partnered or collaborated with the other. So if there is a list of collaborators sponsored by etc., so these people are actually collaborating in the campaign or or somehow supporting the campaigns. So. You have yeah. to find details how they but uh, how they sponsored, how they participated, and what made them collaborate with Shaukat Khanam for this particular uh, campaign, right? And then, okay. uh, then when you mentioned uh, all these things on this page, you must provide details how many people came to seminars, how many seminars were were run, because then you will be okay. reporting all these details. Aapko, you must report all these details in your measurements and results. When we go to measurement okay. and results, we are not seeing, you know, like how many people, uh, how many seminars were held, how many people participated in those seminars. So we'll need, for instance, when we were looking at Vodafone last week, it did say that 3,000 school were invited to participate, and then it also had a number how many. Uh, people submitted entries to to the competition, right? So if you have okay. you have this type of activities here, you have to come up with figures. And when okay. it says printed material, you have to uh, to you have to actually tell uh, tell in your case study what kind of results were received from this kind of 
uh, activity and what results were received through uh, I think you are okay. reporting some, but you are not reporting all. Then you are talking about two different TVCs, right? So did you did you say say okay, what was the creative strategy for both both the TVCs and who was the target audience? I mean, TVCs were same, but they have uh, divided into segments. Like in thirty second and six, the same uh, TVC divided into two. What what, uh, what does this abbreviation stand for? It says S K M C H. What is it? Shokat Khanam, Shokat Khanam Memorial uh, Cancer Hospital. Cancer Hospital. It's, uh, okay. If I so say, write the Shokat Khan, it will be too long. So. Right. Okay. So S K M C H, uh, telecast 60 and 30 second TVCs. So yeah. Uh, so what what is the idea? Big idea behind these TVCs? And then you are saying uh, PR activities. So actually, you sh you need to find out numbers for each one of these, right? Okay, fine. Fine. So, uh, all right. Any other comment? Any other question by anyone? All right. So, key learnings. Kya hongi in this case? And key learning is key. No, man. What are the key learnings for, for this uh, campaign? Key learnings was just to, I mean, uh, as well as we, uh, <laughs> I just lost my, but, uh, through social media, people got more aware as compared to TV because mostly people are not into watching TV. So they are going to. So you're saying the key learning, uh, key learning was that social media was a better platform for this kind of. Yeah. yeah. Ma'am, yeah. key learning, se, I think we have to know the target audience. Ka bhi pata chalta. Ha, key learning jo hai, usme that, that needs addition, right? Or uh, facts, how did you collect kiye? about and the, from their uh, from their pages? I mean, uh, which me uh, links they have mentioned on their website? I have uh, uh, put figures from there. All right. So please, ye jo aapki missing hai na, information about all these collaborations and role of yeah. the collaborators. Is is pe the aap uh, elaborate karein, okay? Okay, ma'am. Okay, ma'am. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, Adnan Hashim, Asan Tahir, present, ma'am, present. Yes, ma'am, present. Okay, Elena, yes, ma'am, Arsal. <laughs> Asma, uh, Faisal, present, ma'am. Hasib, Madiha, present, Muhammad Ahmed, present, ma'am. Ammar, yes, ma'am. Kazim, present, ma'am. Norris, yes, ma'am. Zishan. Present, ma'am. Muzna. Present. Rubab. Present. Sanya. Sanya and Saud. Sanya is present, ma'am. Saud is present, ma'am. Uh, Shaheer. Present. Sharfa. Yes. Uh, Shumaira. Present, uh, Is he here? No, ma'am. Uh, Shumaira. Sundas. Present. Uh, Nawazish. Present. <laughs> Nawazish. Jiji, ma'am. Jiji, Nawazish, where were you? 
मैम ज्वाइन ही नहीं हो रही थी क्लास बड़ी मुश्किल हुई है ड्रॉप हो रही थी बार बार अच्छा चले मैम ये सारी प्रेजेंटेशन आज ही होंगी नहीं आज तो अभी तो नहीं होंगी हम आज का सेशन बस थोड़ी देर में क्लोज कर रहे हैं बट एवरीबडी प्लीज जो है उसको केयरफुली गो थ्रू योर प्रेजेंटेशन और लेट सी जी अच्छा सुंदर प्रेजेंट है शुमाइला प्रेजेंट नहीं है यस मैम टूबा प्रेजेंट मैम जहरा अब सिर्फ शहीर इज एबसेंट ठीक है हम बाकी प्रेजेंटेशन फिर वी विल टेक नेक्स्ट वीक ओके यस मैम यस ओके मैम ऐसा ना करें ओके थैंक यू मैम ये कौन कह रहा है ऐसा ना करें ये मोहम्मद अहमद हफीज कह रहा है नहीं मैम ये कह रहा है नहीं मैम मैं तो बैठ रहा हूं ना नहीं नहीं मैम बैटरी लो है ऑलराइट वी विल डू इट नेक्स्ट वीक ओके यस ओके टेक केयर बाय